Good? Who here knows what a groupie is? Anyone know what a groupie is? Groupie? Yeah. Usually not a really good thing, right? Um, in my group of friends, we usually have that one guy that we call the groupie. We go out to eat, and he somehow always forgets his wallet. And so we have to pay for his meal. That's the groupie. So groupie is our solution to fix that. It's a simple payment app to split money between friends. Uh, my name is Brad Lay. Don't confuse it with Bruce Lee. Brad Lay, not Bruce Lee. And I enjoy building new apps. And this is my partner in crime, Arnau. He thinks he's a JavaScript Jedi. And he also loves building web apps. So our goal for this app is really simple. We wanted to keep it simple. We wanted to provide a lot of information to the user without a lot of visual noise. Um, on top of that, we wanted to make it easy to access and then make it easy to use. So to do that, we ran into some challenges. Yeah, we faced uh, many, many challenges, but these are those who were suffered the most. Actually, the API of PayPal, for example, of the Stripe or Duala, we we try to find one that allows you to do whatever we want, but it's more tricky than, uh, than actually uh, picking what and using it. Because, for example, one allows you to, um, for example, the Stripe, like many to many, it's only for real business uh, company. So we, we can do that because we are not uh, also legal. And for example, uh, API of, of Duala uh, allows uh, an, another thing or feature, but it doesn't fit to our application. So that was kind of hard to find the right API to use. Another one, it's a, a data, database design because we designed the first steps and every time we added new features, we are trying to improve the database because we saw um, as we implement new things, we need to modify in order to uh, improve the functionality. And also the, the third one is the handling, handling the multiple authentications because we are handling uh, real money. So we need to authenticate the user to the front end, back end, and also when we log into to PayPal. So we need to be really protected. What we do our app is we can create an event and add as many items as you want, like, uh, for example, Brad uh, add a beer, I add uh, some food randomly, and I don't know, all of us, we are sharing in this party, so we need to split some payments. So our application will decide, uh, we'll create a total amount and we'll split the payment. And you don't have to be worried about, um, I need to pay uh, that person, that person needs to be paid by that person, so the app, the APP, um, it does it for you. So then you don't have to be worried about that. So you need to pay and, and forget it. Thank you. And now let's see the demo. So as you guys can see, um, we really kept it really simple. Um, it's just groupy for now. You can what? Okay. So we made it responsive for a phone, but this is the super zoomed in version. For example, we have an event here called Beach Volley. It's requesting payments. You could also have multiple events. So when you log in, um, this is the first view you'll see. It's a really simple view. It lists all the events you have um, that you're a part of and then maybe you're a host of. Um, you could, we added buttons on the side so you can kick, click view and this allows you to go into the event itself. So you can see this one's at the state of request. Um, which is requesting payments, but we allow you to add items as well. So R now can add beer, 20, and he can add multiple items. So it expands as you move on, and that's what we meant by we want to keep it simple. We want to provide information, but not too much information. So if you wanted to see on the current 
what items are in there right now, you can go back into the view, and then we keep everything expanded. So if you go back into the view, um, you can click on click to view current items and it'll have a drop down. So it shows everything that you need to see, but it's collapsible so that you don't get overwhelmed with information. After you're done, people pay, and that's it. So on a nutshell, that's our app. Thank you.